Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Monica and in today's video I am going to be doing my first whole house clean with me for the year 2020 and I am so excited for this video. This video did take me two days to film but I did have hockey games to go to and my weekend was extremely busy but I really wanted to do this whole house clean with me to give you guys that motivation. If you guys are in need of any type of cleaning motivation, then I hope this video gives that to you and I hope you guys all enjoy it. So today I'm going to start in the bedroom and what I like to do first is just take all of the sheets off my bed. Today I'm actually taking the protective cover that I have on my memory foam mattress and then the original protective cover that I have on my whole mattress over that. I'm taking both of those off plus my sheets and I'm just going to throw those in the washer and then I'm just going to dust my dresser and the two nightstands that are here in the bedroom and then I'm just going to make my way into the bathroom, do a light cleaning in there because I did do a pretty deep clean the other day and then I'm going to head on into the boys bathroom after I get this room and the bathroom clean. And to dust the dresser down in here, I will be using the Mrs. Meyers Clean Day Multi-Surface Cleaner, and that's in the rose scent. I'm using the same thing for the two nightstands. And then to clean this mirror here, I'm using the Method um, Glass Cleaner, and it is in the mint scent. As we look up at the stars in the sky, did we ever stop and wonder why? We let our love shine all through the night Just you and me, babe, until the morning light The morning light wash the sheets I will be using the sanitize cycle and I love using this OxyClean White Revive along with it instead of bleach and then I will be using the Love Home and Planet, the rose scented laundry detergent and then I will also be using the 7th generation lavender scented fabric softener. So now I'm just going to head on into the bathroom and what I'm going to do here is just put everything away. I do have a lot of like makeup and stuff that I have left out on the counter so I'm just going to quickly clean up in here and just put things away and then to clean the countertops I will be using the same rose scented Mrs. Myers cleaner for the countertops and then for the sinks I will be using some antibacterial wipes just making sure that everything is nice and sanitized and clean. Consequence, I find myself back again, crying on your shoulder. No, it's not good for me, but I still want your body. So dumb, but it's not over. Not very good with decisions. No, it's right, but I don't listen. I don't. I don't. And my complaint in this. If you're 
visiting my channel for the very first time today, I would love to say welcome. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. I truly appreciate it. And I hope that you do consider subscribing to my channel. I would love to have you. So make sure that you hit that subscribe button right now and make sure you hit that bell as well so you are notified each and every time I upload a new video. And I would love it if you stopped by in the comments to say hello. Now that I have the master bedroom and bathroom all clean, I'm heading on into the boys' bathroom. This bathroom is a disaster, and I'm just taking all of the dirty laundry out. I'm throwing it over the railing for now, and I will start a load when I go downstairs. But right now, I'm just going to clear everything off the countertops. I will be cleaning the mirror, the countertops, and the sinks. I did clean the bathroom and the shower area, but the light was broken and I need to have my husband replace the light bulb, but it was just kind of dark in there, so I didn't film that, but I did end up cleaning that area as well. And to clean the mirror, I'm just gonna use the same glass cleaner, the Method glass cleaner. And then for the countertops, I'm actually, actually using the Method. Um, it is the Apple Orchard, I believe. It's for uh, granite and marble. I'm using that in here. And then for the sinks, I am putting gloves on because I'm using a bathroom bleach cleaner. I really don't like to use the bleach cleaner that often because I don't like the way it smells, but this was the cleaner that was under the cabinet area, and I'm just going to stick with what I already have on hand so I'm not running around back and forth from bathroom to bathroom for cleaning products. You packed your things, now we begin the erasing. All the memories slowly start to fade in The days move so slow I know I gotta go But I can't, but I can't, I can't get it My phone, I don't wanna face it. Everything feels wrong, and there's no replacing what we had is gone, and it's all too late. And I'm better off, but I can't deal with this aching. The days move so slow, I know I gotta go, but I can't, but I can't, I can't get anyway. Cause I'm still.
get it through till the darkness turns to light one more night one more night say it's gonna be okay cause this winter is so long feels like it's haunting me say there's gonna be a change cause i feel like i'm just holding on to yesterday but if i wait till the So this video did actually take me two days to film. On the first day when I did all of Upstairs, I had several games, hockey games that I had to go to. Both of my boys are in hockey and my youngest it was in tournament games throughout the whole weekend and I was just really busy and I couldn't get it all done in one day plus film the video. So that is why you see me dress differently and it's nice and bright outside. So just in case you're wondering, I did the upstairs on one day and downstairs the next day. So right here, I just put away all of the dishes that were in the dishwasher. Now I am going to load the dishwasher back up and I will hand wash a few of the dishes and I will be using the Mrs. Meyers Clean Day dish soap and this one is in the honeysuckle. And just to let you know, I did not use the soap on my cast iron pans, but I do like to use the brush that I have sitting here and it just gets everything up really well. And if you're uh, cast iron, if you have cast iron, if it's seasoned really well, you shouldn't have to use soap. But um, I'm just using really hot water and then the brush to just pick up all the pieces of food that are on it. Make sure it's really clean and then I stick it on the stove, heat it back up, and when it's cooled off, I put them away. finished cleaning the dishes I like to clean out my sink really well and I will be using the soft scrub cleanser to do that with a little bit of Dawn dish soap scrub it really really clean and then I like to clean and deodorize my garbage disposal it might not necessarily clean it but I know for sure that it does deodorize it and it leaves behind a really really nice lemon scent and they are these little small lemon planks they're called planks you can get them at Target or Walmart and what you do is you just make sure the water is running ever so slightly and then you turn your garbage disposal on and then you just drop one of them down and let it run for a few seconds and then you're good to go and they smell amazing <music> Now that I have all the dishes put away, I'm going to wipe down my countertops and I will be using the Love Home and Planet Multi-Purpose Cleaner and this one is in the Bulgarian Rose scent. It smells so, so good. It kind of reminds me of like a rose and vanilla mix scent. It's pretty different from the Mrs. Meyers Rose. The Mrs. Meyers Rose have more, has more of a natural rose scent, like fresh cut roses, and this one has like a vanilla, a hint of vanilla to it. Um, they both smell really, really good, and they are both my favorites right now.
just want to take a quick second and tell you a little bit about these placemats. This is not a sponsored video, but this company did send me these jute placemats and I absolutely love them. I have worked with this company in the past. They have sent me some jute baskets and some other jute items and I have loved all of their products. So if you guys are interested in these super adorable jute placemats, I will leave a link in my description box for you. Now that I have the huge pile of laundry put away, I am just going to go throughout my entire downstairs and I'm just going to lightly dust everything and I'm just using a Swiffer duster. I'm not using any type of dusting product at all and this works really well. I'm just going to go ahead around the house like I said and just dust everything and then I'm going to vacuum and mop.
being picked up off the floor and I just vacuumed. I'm going to mop my floors and I did see this on Pinterest and I thought I would try it. It is just a little bit of vegetable glycerin with some essential oils. I will be using the tangerine and the sweet orange for this and some super, super hot water. I thought it cleaned really well. It did a good job, but I probably will use some type of cleaner next time. It did leave the floors smelling amazing with the essential oils and the water was pretty dirty, so either my floors were really dirty or it did a really good job cleaning. There weren't any like suds or soapiness, but um, I felt like it really did a good job cleaning the floors and everything smelled really nice and clean when I was finished. And we just sing along And I can't help but feeling Just loving this moment Can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment Can we stay here together? If I could stop the time Don't you know that I would? Cause I'm just loving this moment Can we stay here forever? that is it for today's video I hope it brought you tons of cleaning motivation and I also want to thank you so much for watching it all the way to the end it truly means so much to me if you enjoyed this video please be sure to give me a thumbs up make sure that you subscribe if you are new and I hope you guys all have an amazing day see you in the next one bye you drive do you know i'm looking